What's up everybody, it's Vivian and welcome back to my channel and today I'm going to be doing a tutorial. I've seen this a lot in my comments and I realized that my one video is wrong. Um, I did a video on how to render on After Effects, but it turns out that there was an update on this computer, I'm a Mac user so I don't know if it's different for Windows, that the settings to nor that you would normally render, which you would go over here, and it would be, um, let me see, it would... You would go down the format and it would be like H2624, something like that, but it is not here. And so I'm going to be showing you guys how I render and save my edits to my phone in 2020. Okay, so now that you're here, normally if you've been using After Effects for a while, you would go to what I did, format options, and choose that setting. But the way that I'm doing it is through an app called Handbrake. It is literally free, it's downloadable. I don't know if it's for, I think I think it's only for Mac, but I don't know, I'm, I'm sure you can use it for other users. Don't ask me on that. But it's called Handbrake. So get that, that is crucial when doing this process. So what you're gonna do here is normally you would do these settings, like I said, but what you're gonna do here is where it says audio output. We're gonna put it on because if I didn't, then when I I see right here the silent audio track would be shown so I did this at first and I did it through a handbrake and it had no sound so make sure you put audio on and that is it that is all you do over here and you press ok and you let it render Once you hear that ding, that lets you know that your edit is rendered it is saved so what you're gonna do is go up to where it says file file um, save as, okay, save as, it's important, and I'm just going to name this YouTube, and I have it saved to my desktop, which honestly it doesn't matter when it comes to handbrake, but desktop is just easier for me to see it, so I save, so it's there, and so you go, I'm going to minimize After Effects and ignore all my desktop stuff, <laughs> um, so the edit is here, right? here but it's not to a format where it can be sendable to a phone so this is what handbrake does this is the app right here what handbrake does is it just converts it to the kind of format you need what you're going to do is you're going to open source and that is where you're going to get your video edit now it's not going to have a cover but because um i knew how long the second how long this video was it's only three seconds this is the one that i'm going to use and it's already going to show you the thumbnail you know what it looks like so there's my edit right there perfectly normal and sometimes you might have to mess with the dimensions because it might be off so that's something you have to play around with but looks like my dimensions are pretty good and it can show you a preview if you want to see it but it's kind of the same concept you're just going to press start shit it looks like i have a lot of storage so um i'm going to just show you what would really happen if this rendered i would press start it would go and it would go all the way like in a line just like After Effects and then it would save and then it would come in my desktop and I have all this crap over here but I'm not going to delete it. So I'm just going to show you with a video that I already have that's already, you know, been rendered and stuff. So I would just press, you would right click and you would share and you would airdrop and literally all you do is send it to your phone. That's it. So um, it would, someone, someone's phone would pop up and then that would be that. That's literally it. This video would just be seen over here and it's just, I have to fix my computer storage so it's not hard at all and that's literally all you have to do and you have a rendered edit. So thank you guys for watching this quick tutorial. If you liked it, subscribe to my channel and I'll see you guys next time. Bye!